Welcome to my channel, I'm Polly. Today I'm gonna to be doing a review and tutorial on the new Lawless Forget the Filler Cherry Vanilla Collection. I absolutely love Lawless Beauty. I have used a, quite a few of their products now and they're basically like a clean luxury brand. And I there's actually not many clean luxury brands out there. So I really get excited to try their products because I just know that they're going to be high quality and they have good ingredients that aren't harmful that you're applying especially when it's like a lip product i feel like that's very important they launched the overnight lip plumping mask which i have used before and i will go through why and why i love this mask what i love about it who i think it's best suited for forget the filler lip plumping line smoothing tinted bomb stick and i've used that before in a different shade as well and kind of the i'll share with you the reasons why i love each of these products for different reasons of course the cherry vanilla forget the filler lip plumping gloss which i'm going to use today and show you guys the tutorial and how i like to apply it for. and they have a queen size forget the filler lip plumping line smoothing gloss so an extra large one which i don't know if they've ever launched but it is big it's actually warranted because they're um watermelon Forget the filler lip gloss I used in the summer and I actually did go through it really fast. So it's definitely easy to go through these products just because they're beautiful. Having an extra large version, I think is amazing. I love the whole cherry cola lip look, which is basically like a cool tone brown liner smudged in with a cherry red glossy lip color in the middle. So let's start off with the overnight mask. I have used this in a couple different flavors before and this is what i use it's like the middle of winter right now this is what i use when my lips really start to be challenging and they start to kind of just really getting too dried out so i have this on my bedside table and i just literally when i'm laying in bed going to bed it's so easy to grab if you just put it next to you in when you're laying in bed and put it on your lips and in the morning your lips are just so much more hydrated on the skin it does have a little tint to it you can see the kind of difference between my skin tone and the lip product i didn't find it transferred to my bed sheets at all and it has a very very gentle gentle subtle plumping effect so it's nothing crazy when you're lying in bed like you don't want an overwhelming plumping feeling but it does also make your lips look nice and hydrated it makes you look kind of nice before bed too which i really like to do it just makes me feel good when i'm getting ready for bed my skin's all glowy my lips are hydrated and glowy as well i love this product for helping through the winter months especially when the lips are chapped tinted balm stick i love this product for obviously on the go kind of more i don't want to say like low maintenance occasions but like more on the go busy throw it in your bag situation so you can see this has definitely a bit of a pigment to it you can see it on the skin which is great we definitely want that with a cherry lip color like this and they all have that lip plumping kind of effect to it this honestly could be used as well with the with a, the brown lip liner and have that same cherry cola kind of look if you don't want to go full gloss i just love the gloss look with it because the contrast is so nice and the depth but a product like this is easy to throw in your bag and just apply on any occasion and you just don't have to deal with gloss if you're not in the mood for it a little bit more like a lipstick but it's hydrating so it adds a lot of moisture and shine to the lips and the obviously the main product we're talking about is the lip plumping forget the filler cherry vanilla lip gloss so i absolutely love these glosses they're one of my top glosses in my makeup bin in my makeup world the i love the applicator on this it's like a kind of like an angled doe foot which is just a little bit different than other products out there so it applies on the lip really nicely i'll show you guys when i do my tutorial how i apply it, it smells really nice and just a very light cherry and vanilla flavor so exactly like the name it's absolutely delicious it's not too overwhelming it's definitely like subtle but just the perfect amount it has that classic plumping factor to it which i'm just so used to it now i honestly this is like my comfort zone plumping level i feel like this lawless plumping factor i'm just comfortable with so it works for me and i love having a extra large size because i've already used this a little bit and we're down to here like i've had it in my makeup bag so when it's a gloss this good you go through it just to add to all of this amazingness this is like this brand is clean everything so no 
bad products cruelty free like that's so important when you're putting a product on your lip like it's your mouth stay tuned i'll show you guys how i like to use this gloss in a makeup look and i'll show you how i applied my lip today first thing i'm going to do is line my lips obviously my lips are hydrated i've been using that mask at nighttime so my lips are kind of prepped and um and ready to go maybe i will i might layer this for you so you can see both products on i'm going to start with lip liner as always i'm going to use two lip liners today because sometimes i just like mixing them so i'm going to use this one by makeup forever in anywhere caffeine it's a pencil lip liner it's just a really beautiful brown color kind of neutral brown color i always trace the lip Underneath, I overline a little bit and then draw upwards to the corner and then fill in a little bit of the corner for that sharp definition. I don't overline on the outer corners, I go into the natural line. And I do the natural line and then overline a bit on top on the cupid's bow to add a little plumpness to the middle. Then I went in with this lip liner from Rinna Beauty. I also really love Rinna Beauty lip liners. They're fine tip and just beautiful and creamy. This is in Notice Me. I use this one all the time. I just sometimes add, like to add a little more color on my cupid's bow like on the top of the lip to make sure it's defined and it just makes it look more full and plump lip liner really is everything so the palm stick i'll show you guys kind of just how this starts off looking so it's definitely more of a lipstick kind of finish on the lips and feel like satiny kind of look but it definitely has a really nice pop of red and it's almost like a little bit more on the pinky side so just so you can see what that ends up looking like main thing is this cherry vanilla gloss that we're going to be putting on i never swatched this on my arm just to show you guys kind of right before i go in how much pigment this gloss actually has so you can see it has quite a pop of cherry pigment on it I will add the gloss to my lip now. It does, now that I'm kind of looking at it in this lighting, it does have like a, a lightness to it, like a pinky lightness to it. Maybe it's like the warm tone red coming through. So it's not like deep cherry. Some products are more on the deep cherry side, but I'd say this is more on the light, like pinker, bright cherry side. And then I always like putting a lot on my top lip just because I want, I love going on the cupid's bow because I feel like it really makes it shine and almost lift and the lips look a little more full and juicy. So this is the final lip look using the new Lawless Cherry Vanilla Forget the Filler Plumping Lip Gloss. Beautiful and fresh that lip is. I feel like it's so classic and flirty and complimenting on the skin. It'll be a great look coming up for Valentine's Day, but like all the time, this is an amazing look. Don't forget to like this video down below and follow me at hall underscore ward on YouTube. I post every single week and don't forget to head over to Instagram as well and follow me at hall underscore ward. As always, I hope you have a wonderful week and I'll see you next time.